Well, welcome to the next video. <laughs> Today is a topic about ammunition, but not the ammunition itself. It's storage and labeling. I use a lot of MTM cases for ammo, and I never knew they actually made labels for the cases and the boxes. So that's what the topic of the today video is about. I bought their labels in different calibers. As you can see, I didn't buy everything, but because I don't have everything. But certain things are very helpful because I have a lot of 223, a lot of 556, and a gazillion of 22 and 9 mil. Those are my most common calibers. And for everything else, you can use their strange label. <laughs> That's what I'm going to call the reloader labels, I'm going to say. Because you can write on these. They're not going to be as visible remotely at distance. And for the mags that are mag specific, they have boxes of for magazines. Rifle, pistol, mixed. This is nice to identify those boxes remotely. And I bought several packages from Amazon or Midway USA, depending on what labels we are talking about. This is what these look like. Ammo caliber labels. 45, 308, 22. So those are the MTM ones. However, they're not the only ones that I was buying. Those came from Midway USA, which obviously I cannot provide a link to because they sell guns. Thank you, YouTube. I found alternative labels on Amazon from this, I guess, a Chinese company. I don't know much about them. But I bought their labels to test and I used up 762 by 39. I bought a lot of these. This is their 762 by 39 package. And believe me, I'm probably going to use all of these. I already used one of them almost up and I need some more. I personally put it on the top of a box. I don't put it on the side um, how MTM represents their on, uh, on their photos, I put it on the top. So here is an example. This is a 556, right? Can you see it? And of course you cannot, because it's not in there. So I put it on the top right here. This is not an <clears throat> MTM label, this is the other one. 762 by 39 on top, and this is another label pack also from the same company. And for these I will provide the link. This is their kind of universal label set. Prime has multiple calibers. 12 gauge, 22, 22, 23, Remington, 300, Blackout. 40, 45, 6.5 Grendel, mags. Many of these are going to be useful. I have these calibers. And I did not see anybody else making 6.5 Grendel label. And of course, there is a 9, 10, 30, 30, 30 out 6, and so forth and so forth. Even 308, 307 Magnum, 380 ACP, 38 Special, and so forth and so forth until we get to the fun one. These are the intermediate <laughs> calibers. Do you see a problem in this label? I did. Because I honestly don't know what 556 by 39 is, but I do know what 545 by 39 is. And I presume that's what it was supposed to be. So they do make a mistake. I did communicate it to the manufacturer via Amazon or to the seller. Let's see what they respond with. Hopefully they will fix it on the next label. Is it an issue? Not really. I don't need 545 labels quite that much. I might use it just for the fun of it because it's as close to 545 as possible. I will use the 556 label because I'm sorting my ammo out right now. As you can see, these are my recent purchases uh, and deliveries from either local gun stores or my ammo squared subscription. And I will use those labels. And again, I'm going to provide my link. That's an Amazon affiliate link. If you buy it, use it. 
If not, not a problem at all, of course. It will help the channel a little bit, but it's a sense. My goal is to show something useful to you guys and girls, of course. Those are fairly good labels. They seem to stick well. And they cover calibers that many of us have. MTM labels uh, are probably different in uh, material and there are definitely more of them in the package because this is actually a very long pack. I have used some. But again, it all depends what you need to accomplish. And all of this is very inexpensive. Midway USA for MTM, I'm sure Amazon has them, but I was buying from Midway something else anyway. And Amazon, those are going to be the links below in the description for the... I'm going to break this name, probably. Aola Megs. Aola Megs Ammo Can Vinyl Stickers. They also show them on the side, which is not the way I'm planning to use it. That's all. Well, let me continue sorting my ammo. I'm sorting different boxes, 55 from 62 grain, so that the boxes are going to be only one ammo type. Until next video, and enjoy, and remember to be practical, you need to practice.